Let's watch Jeremiah Kioni over his remarks to President Ruto. Yeah. I was critical of Ruto before I knew he was going to run. Mm. When he was a member of parliament for Sugoi area, that uh, Eldoret North, Eldoret North mm. I, I filed a motion of impeachment on the floor. It was when he was there and as a minister of agriculture that we had the miscado in this country. So it's a person, it's nothing personal, but his, uh, his, his drive is different. His drive is towards some gratonious levels that's unbelievable. He believes in himself only, he doesn't consult anybody. And whatever he decides is right is what you must do, whether you like it or not. That's not the kind of a person you want at the helm. So I knew him. May I even say that I had my own misgivings even when they came together with the Uhuru during 2013. Really? Yes. You were going to start. And we had, we, we but sat, you are listen, buddy. we sat and said, <laughs> yeah. we have to be careful. Yes. <laughs> this gentleman, yeah. we don't know what it is that we are taking on board. Mm. But the realities of the time, the ICC and the issues that were there crowded that kind of reasoning and we needed to move on as a country. So, if you see me being critical, it's not to William. Mtoto wa baya alisariwa na mama Pandi ya uko Nandi Apana It is to his way of doing things He has very He is very ambitious And very very pushy But his capacity is completely zero And he has no room to accommodate Any view from any other person And he is also a bit Vengeful Not a bit Yeah, That you have not seen from him yeah. But uh, his vengeance, yeah. uh, you can see it. When they left office with Uhuru, the first person he attacked was Uhuru. Mm. So ni mutu tena anajiripia, anajiripishia kisasi na nibofu. Mm. Kwa siyasa, haina maneno ya, ya, ya kujiripia kisasi. Mm. You don't go that way. Politics, you pull and you pull, you yeah. pull differently. Mm. But once you are in power, you never use your power to hurt any other person. Mm. Never use it. Mm. Edelea, ruka tikibaki. Edelea, we umalize wende. That is Jeremiah Kioni. Kioni President in the Republic of Kenya. He knew Ruto even before he became the deputy president in the Republic of Kenya. <laughs> that is what Jeremiah Kioni is saying. Kioni is regretting and never now, cannot now believe that the same person whom he rushed to judge is the president. Is this is not something which I talked about? And this is a clear indication that people normally sit in a community after Kenyans have, vo have voted. They sit in a community group and select the person of their own desire. And that is why we normally fail as Kenyans and also in African leadership. Total failures. The people in the community are greedy and they are even being sponsored. For instance, a good example, assume the presidency. Giving them money just to cater for their basic needs. They are well comfortable. And also just a kind of pampering the presidency throne. That is what I have seen from Jeremiah Kionis remarks over William Ruto's succeeding in this life. After all those political emulation, he's saying that he knew Kioni, he knew Ruto when he was with Uru Kenyatta. Well, it's good you know William Ruto. But what have you gained or what have you, you helped Kenyans with? To help President Ruto not to repeat the same mistake which he's doing as a president. Because there's no perfect leader in this country or in this world. 
Leaders experience a lot in life. Challenges are there and you must accept the challenges. Kion is just thumping for nothing. It is late, my brother Kioni. This your speech, I could have used it in some months ago, in some years ago. But today, you are now coming a day after Rigadi Gashagwa had been impeached. You could have even used it to advise your son Rigadi Gashagwa to know Ruto Basi. Why we always after? Uh, why we always spilling uh, spilling the beans after mistake? Eh? Then we call ourselves leaders. Safari e uja, safari ya bamba ni macheo. Na pendanga iyo wimbo sana. Lazima tuzingatie vile tuwaweza ishi. Na imani katika taifa letu hii. Tuachane na siasa ya chuki. Tuachane na siasa ya umbwakri. Tuwe wale ambao kila mkenya pande yote. Anaweza muka na seme enyewe tukona viongozi wenye wanatu turumie. But let us not always have that time to say one or two, three things after things have fallen apart. Maji ya kimwagika ayazoleki kioni. It's late and very late. Ladies and gentlemen, I rest my case at this point and I wish you all the best. Thank you so much for your always great support in this broadcast. I don't take it for granted. I appreciate you and to the new subscribers, may God bless you and thank you so much. As you bother the same boat with the members, please consider to give this video a thumb of like. When you like this video, it will reach to several people in the YouTube platform. And if you are watching me for the first time, having interest to proceed with this political discussion, I request you. Kindly take a one second and click that notification bell and subscribe to our YouTube channel. In that, next time, when I upload to you such kind of a video, the YouTube will notify you automatic, automatically. Bye-bye and let's meet for the next political discussion. Meanwhile, drop your opinion over Keone's remarks.